This is the new Juvia's Place, the coffee shop collection. If you wanna see how I achieve this look, keep watching. I've already done my eyebrows and I will be priming my lids with shade number two. I know it looks crazy, but don't worry about it. The shades don't have names, so I'm just gonna pick this shade. And I'm gonna use that as my transition color. Pigment, yes. All right, I'm gonna go in with the second shade. I'm gonna put that in the crease. The mats are actually, they're not cakey. They are not tagging on my eyelids. They are pretty good. I'm gonna go in with the dark shade. The corner of my eye. I'm gonna pick that shade. Without adding any product, I'm just gonna blend the two shades. In a clean brush, I'm gonna blend all that up here. I'm gonna take a pencil brush and I'm gonna that shade. I'm gonna put it on the corner of my eye. I'm gonna prime my face and I'm gonna be using the milk primer. I'll be using Juvia's Place foundation and this is in the shade Zaria. Ay, ay, ay. I was afraid it would be too red, but when I blended it out, it doesn't look too, too bad comparing uh, with my neck. I'll be using the concealer shade number 12. I'm gonna let that dry a bit. So I'm gonna set that. I'll use a Charlotte Tilbury. This is the Airbrush Flawless Finish in shade number three. This is Bella. This is their blush. I'm beginning to like blush. I was not a blush person, but it's growing on me. Look at that highlighter. That highlight is Royalty One. Ah, niga kalika. Wana yifunguki. And since it's a loose highlighter, I like to put it on the cap because I don't want to go overboard. And I just put just a little bit like that. And that is even a lot. Ooh, baby. Ooh, baby. Yes. Let's add some more. Look at that. Bam. Bam. I'm gonna use LYS. This is the No Limits Strength Dark Contour. This is the number four. For my bottom lashes, I'm gonna go in with this shade right here. I have been loving this Item Beauty Lash Mascara. Look at that brush. It is really small and it really gets to pick all the itty bitty hairs that I have, especially the bottom lashes. This is a Sephora Micro Smooth Powder and I'm gonna use that to take care of everything, bring everything together and make it look smooth. I'm gonna wear my lashes and then I'll come back, we do the swatches for the lip glosses. I used Adele Remy lashes and this is in number 778. So we're gonna swatch the lip liner. The first one is Coco Latte. That's how Coco Latte looks like. Coffee bean. Obviously slightly lighter than the first one. Espresso. Oh wow. 
That one is dark, dark, like dark. <laughs> and I'm gonna do the lip swatches for the glosses without the liner so that you can see how the true color looks like. Hold on, I got a shimmy for this one. Kenyan coffee, because representing. Hope she looks good. Oh, yes. By the way, the doe foot applicator on these things are so nice. That is how it looks like. So it's easy to really line your lips. They, man, this tastes so good, this smell good. By the way, if you've not had our Kenyan coffee, we have the best tasting coffee out there. Uh, just a PSA. If you're loving this content, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Let's keep going. On camera, it looks like it's really, really like almost black liner. Sometimes I don't really, really like. I like to maybe blend it in a bit. I'm gonna use my lip brush and this one is from Sigma and I'm gonna see if I can blend this. So that looks a bit better, but for the sake of the video, I just wanted to show you how that looks like. Pretty dark for lip liner. Pretty dark that I would normally go for. So I say, if you have espresso and cocoa latte, they are pretty similar to me. You don't need both if you don't wanna pick the full collection. So the other liner is Coffee Bean. I feel like this one will be a really popular one. And I'm gonna use Coffee Bean with Honey Honey. Honey Honey reminds me of a, of a shade from Mented Cosmetics, the one that says Send Nudes. Looks like the same. So now this is more up my alley, like with a more not too, too dark of a lip liner and a gloss. I absolutely love this. I wanna see how Espresso looks like compared to their other lip liner called Cola. This is Coffee Bean. This is Cola, not part of the collection, but one of their liners. A Cola is slightly lighter than Coffee Bean. How about Chestnut from MARC? Pretty light. And this is a BFF3. This is the collab with Makeup Shayla and Colourpop. And I also really love this one. So you can see they're pretty different, but Chestnut and BFF3 are pretty similar. Here are some comparison shades I wanted to show you guys. This is the, the Coffee Collection palette. And this is uh, Nubia. This is the, the very, very original. They are pretty different. You have a little bit of some red in there. This is the Warrior palette. So they look pretty, pretty similar to me. Of course you have more shadows on here than you have on this one. This is the Nomad. I wouldn't quite say they're similar. This is different. You have some yellows in here. You have a green in here, but the shimmers, they could, you know, maybe the same, but again, just for comparison's sake, that's how they look like. Thank you so much guys for watching. Oh, and by the way, there are more videos for you to watch somewhere here. I'll put it somewhere there.